Uh, my name is Eddie Campagna, and uh, I tattooed at Body Art Gallery. And my Instagram is uh, at Boston Eddie underscore. The good vibes, man. Uh, first of all, we have a really good vibe here at Body Art Gallery. Uh, I really, really enjoy tattooing here. Uh, I like to do a lot of dark um, black and gray. Uh, Lost goals, pretty much. Um, I used to really be into bio mech, but I'm not really into that so um, anymore. But I like to try to incorporate a little of like maybe a little or organic, bio organic stuff with it. Um, I really like to tattoo uh, like animals too. I did a really cool uh, lion recently with a a crown and a and a realistic rose and stuff like. Um, that was probably like one of my more favorite ones recently. Um, that was really fun. I'd like to do more stuff like that. Um, when I first started tattooing, I was, I was real. I really liked a lot of the the Paul Booth and Edward Lee, like stuff like that, and uh, how I go. <clears throat> and that was like a lot of stuff that I was drawing, you know, anything skulls and stuff like that. But the more I, the more I I got into tattooing, the more people wanted like color tattoos and it was getting real, you know, more more and more color, color, color and mm -hmm. after that it was just, like, now lately I just feel like I'm trying to get back into what I originally wanted to do was black and gray and so I think being able to get back into something that I really enjoyed doing in the first place that I didn't get to do very often is what kind of makes it, <clears throat> not that I put more into it, but it just, it, it feels like more of my style, more I, what I like to do. Most recently, we, we just did the Empire State in New York, and uh, man, that was awesome. I mean, there's, it, there's so many good tattooers there, and uh, the vibe was great. I, I guess it, it kind of, you know, is a good influence on me to uh, maybe do that more mm -hmm. and uh, not be a, afraid, I guess, to to put yourself out in other areas and stuff. So, mm -hmm. and, uh, being able to see Ground Zero was like was pretty impactful for me because of. <clears throat> I, you know, most Americans remember that day. If you're, you know, if you weren't born after that, I I just remember everything about that day and just being like, oh my God, like I couldn't imagine being there and actually walking down that same street and being able to see like where the towers were was like it was really insane. It, it just put everything into more perspective on you know how things were. When we went to the Met, I mean that was that was a good time. It, um, it just to see different artwork other than uh, just tattoos like all the time, just to see like sculptures and paintings and stuff from you know all the different eras. It was really cool. Um, I really enjoyed it. We didn't get to see like the whole thing, but uh, we got kicked out only oh, because we ran out of time. We didn't do anything bad, but. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I mean, uh, priorities, I guess, with um, with me would be, uh, I mean, anything anything that I have free free reign for. Um, um, if you're looking for uh, something black and gray, like um, really, I'm really trying to push my black and gray a lot more uh, um, realism as well. Um, <clears throat> so anything skulls, uh, uh, roses. I love tattooing roses too. So. Um, Black and gray, gray uh, realism, roses, uh, skulls, um, anything that, you know, is dark, dark, <laughs> get dark. So, um, to, to book appointments with me, you can find me on uh, Instagram, it's uh, at Boston Eddie underscore, um, Facebook, Eddie Campagna, um, that's about it. <clears throat> what, uh, what do you want from me?